Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today showing you how to remove the shortcut arrow icon in Windows 10 or 11. We're going to get rid of this arrow right here that you see on any of your shortcuts. Easy to do. A couple things you'll want to know. So follow along. We're going to want to download Remove the Shortcut Arrow icon in Windows 10 or 11. Check the video description below. Sometimes you have to expand it and you'll see the link to grab this here. Download it. Extract the files anywhere you want. But here's the important part. To make it go away, we need a blank dot icon. Basically, it's a transparent icon. So what we're going to do is go to wherever you downloaded and extracted the files. Here's mine in a folder right here. Here's your blank dot ICO icon. Expand your C drive on the left where you have Windows installed. Look for Windows and take it over here to Windows. You have to be an administrator. Click continue. And now we've copied that file to Windows. Next thing you want to do is double click remove. As you can see, we have remove and restore. So we're going to double click remove, hit run, click yes, click yes again, and click OK. So now we want to see how it works. So let's go ahead and restart Explorer. We can do that with, we'll close Explorer for now, Windows key plus X, click on Task Manager, find Explorer if it's open. Here's your more details if you don't see it. If it's open, you'll see it right here. If not, just scroll down maybe from here and look for the yellow folder. That kind of makes it stand out. There it is. Right click, restart. Your screen will flash. Every once in a rare while, your taskbar won't come back. If it does that, press the Windows key, and it usually comes right back. So as you can see on our desktop, all our icons are gone. Nice clean look, right? So here's two things you want to know. To remove it, you don't have to. It's a really small image. But you can go back to Windows and delete the blank dot ICO file right here. If you don't put it in a folder, you'll see a spot here. So again, to remove it, go ahead and delete the blank dot ICO if you want. But again, Bear in mind, it's only 20 kilobytes, so it's not going to change your life much. Go back to the files you downloaded and double-click Restore, and that will put the arrows back on your desktop. All right, one last thing I want to show you. Maybe you want to put that icon somewhere else. What you're going to want to do is go to the remove.reg file, right-click, open with, and use Notepad. Click Run when prompted. Here's what you're looking for right here. So let's say you wanted to put it in the C drive. You could just clear this out, or you could note the double backslash. So I say I want to do Windows System 32. I would do backslash backslash S-Y-S-T-E-M 32. That allow you to put the file there. But again, kind of pointless, but if you want to do it, File, Save, or when you exit, click Save. So, in my opinion, keeping it in Windows makes it easy to find for you later if you need it. And that's basically it right there. It's all built into the Major Geeks window tweaks as well, where you, you can find that link right here. So that's part of that. You might want to look through that, see if there's anything else you want to do. Some pretty cool stuff in there. I'm pretty proud of that. And, uh, yeah, that bell covers it. And there you go. It's a really neat look, don't you think? I like the cleanliness of it. It's smooth. And there you have it. That's how you can remove those annoying shortcut arrow icons in Windows 10 and 11. You know the drill. Bottom right hand corner is the subscribe button. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.